Hello and welcome on my channel, I'm MadCats and today I'm gonna show you how to use Chroma key in OBS. Stay with me. Right, when you in the program, you will see uh, probably black screen or anything like that. We're going to do step by step how to add a webcam, how to put the background or whatever you want and how to apply a Chroma key correctly. So I'm gonna add a new scene, let's say seal one which is your black screen now, it probably looks how your screen would look when you don't have any source inside. First you want to do is add a video capture device which is your camcorder, webcam. Let's name it webcam, do you remember that what it is? Now you choose your webcam from this option. I also gonna the custom uh, resolution because I want to choose full HD and video format that is all default. I'm gonna keep it default. Also, I want to configure the video for the best settings, but I think or I already did it. So I put the cancel. So scene one. Now I will make it a bit bigger. It's full HD now device custom I prefer custom because I can set my resolution and I can set anything as I want now of course full HD make it a bit too big but that's fine now as you see you can only see uh, me everything what this camera picks from the room I record uh, even my irony table uh, my clothes everything that we don't want now also there's a light here because if you don't have it it will produce shadows on the green screen and the last thing you want are shadows i show you why now now you have to apply chroma key and manage your webcam you basically select your webcam right click and put filters on um, in the effect filters, you have to put add plus or add, right click add chroma key. Chroma key, I leave it like this. Now it automatically goes to green color. You can choose green, blue, magenta, or custom any color you want. Let's say green. Now, as you see here, I have a shadow that I don't want because it will destroy. Uh, background image video or anything it's in there so I have another source of source of light which is LED for batteries look I light it up a bit it's not fully up the shadows disappear that's what you want you want to light your green screen as much as you can the green screen has to be the same everywhere now we basically move the similarity to the point where uh, there are no green edges on your body or anywhere. So I set it like here. That's good for me. Smooth. Smoothness is to make the edges more smooth. Like this is non. You see that sharp edges. I show you that here. Sharp edges. We don't want that. So I put it smooth to the bit to the right. That's okay because when you put it more and more then it's gonna shit your screen now that's not good so i leave it like here when you make the the webcam a bit smaller then it's not important because people are not gonna see that much you can make it black and white if you want i don't want to you can change contrast brightness gamma now anything you change in these filters contrast brightness gamma gonna not affect the green screen results now the only thing that's gonna affect it is your camera settings so mind that i'm pretty happy for this tutorial with this color screen and along the colors brightness and cameras are gonna lift it as it is now because they want that other things to be shown i'm gonna apply crop and i'm gonna crop my images simply by doing this like this 200 for example perfect 400 even more 500 
perfect I'm gonna probably put it even more 550 perfect and put it even higher or you can just move your green screen uh, to the more comfortable place you want now bottom I'm gonna stay or maybe 100 so it will be more uh, panorama view as you see close it's all set up now now you see I'm now in, in the background okay that's what you want and you can still see some green edges so you can configure your settings to the results you want you're looking for now we're gonna add something on the background uh, media source was it yes I think media source then I'm gonna look into my videos perfect now it is higher than the webcam so it's shown first i need to put a webcam higher than the video is and now this is the effect you're looking for you are in the video right that's you can stream like this you can record uh, videos like this that's what you're looking for that's it for today's tutorial if this tutorial helped you then like the videos that will be very nice from your side also if you want to see my content regularly then make sure to subscribe to the channel and, and press the, to receive the notification make sure to check the tutorial how to use the chroma key in xplit and sony vegas pro 13 thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next video